Well, AMD is taking on Intel in the CPU market, especially when it comes to consumer CPUs. And now they're going after NVIDIA when it comes to ray tracing technology, apparently, maybe not. We'll see what happens. It's good to see competition in this market, though. AMD has recently filed several new patents focusing on ray tracing technology, signaling their commitment to enhancing RT or ray tracing capabilities in their future graphics hardware. This move comes shortly after NVIDIA introduced new ray tracing technologies utilizing neural shaders in January 2025. So what are AMD's new patents? Well, one of them is about neural network-based ray tracing. This suggests AMD is exploring the use of neural networks to improve the efficiency and quality of ray tracing similar to NVIDIA's neural shaders. The article here notes that perhaps this approach will be more accepted now that AMD is pursuing it. The other one is transversal and procedural shader bounds. This likely relates to optimizing how rays are traced through complex scenes and how procedural content interacts with ray tracing. Now, there are more patents filed by AMD, and you can follow the link that's provided inside this article, and I will link to this article in the YouTube description down below if you're interested in checking it out. Of course, there can be parallels drawn between NVIDIA's DLSS and AMD's Fidelity FX Super Resolution. This is FSR, so this move by AMD indicates certainly that future hardware such as their anticipated our DNA 5 architecture and the next generation of consoles, PlayStation 6 and the next Xbox, that'll be interesting to see, are expected to have significant improvements when it comes to ray tracing and potentially even path tracing capabilities. Of course, none of this is going to happen tomorrow. This is going to probably take a few more years to tweak and finalize. But like I said at the beginning, it's wonderful to see Competition, competition hopefully means lower prices. <laughs> I know, I know. I'm not sure that will happen, but we can always hope. But it will spur innovation and creativity. It's a good thing to have happen. And let's hope AMD continues to have lots and lots of success. And as well, of course, Intel in the GPU space. And if you are still watching this video, you are 100% kick-ass and you have a 100% kick-ass attention span. Congratulations.